this is a very difficult disease to diagnose, um, often delayed, which means that we've led to, um, not just from the delay, but, but, but because of the clinical presentation, there is an amazing um, variety of clinical presentation, age, and severity of the symptoms that each patient demonstrates. And I think that even the most um, experienced clinician has never seen two MPC patients look the same. And with that said, those things influence the interventions, uh, the quality of life that individual patients may experience, um, the, uh, and, and given, and possibly we believe that the severity or how progressed the disease is may also um, impact a response to the, to the disease or to the intervention for the disease. So it's been difficult to find one type of intervention that's going to suit all types of patients. Uh, we also have not had a intervention yet that has been tested that has led to significant um, immediate benefit for patients and that has eventually led to approval. And so as of yet, when a family has you know, a diagnosis of a child in their family with Nemopixy, they don't have something that they can just readily obtain that, will, that they know with certainty will impact the course of the disease. There are, um, as mentioned, there are trials to that, that are looking promising, and, and I think that the IV cyclodextrin trial is, is particularly promising. Um, but as of yet, we just don't have that, um, that information.